welcome back to the channel welcome back to another video guys today i'm in the kitchen i'm gonna make some jamaica red pea soup yes i have some pig's tail and some smoked turkey neck that i've already soaked in some water for like two hours and i'm gonna boil this for 15 more minutes to take out some of the salt not all the salt because we still want some of the salt in it of course but we don't want it too salty so i'm gonna boil that for 15 more minutes and get everything ready but in the meantime over here i have some chicken foot some chicken breast some gizzard some octopus yes octopus because when i'm making red pea soup honestly i like a lot of meat in my red pea soup that's me use whatever meat you like so i have all these meat in it and i'm gonna make my red pea soup and as you can see i added a little seasoning to my meat here because i like to add a little seasoning to my meat i didn't add any to the pig seal and the turkey neck because those are already salty but i added a little green seasoning and everything to this you know just give it a little flavor and everything so i'm gonna get my peas ready and i'm also gonna add some peanuts into my peas yes this red pea soup is gonna turn up so let's go ahead so look that's the smoked turkey neck with the pig tail those are boiling away as i said i'm gonna give it 15 minutes and i'm gonna throw up that water and i'm gonna put it into this but I'm gonna add some more water to this. That's the peas right there. I'm gonna add some more water to it to cover it so everything can go in and start, you know, cooking. Guys, I finished boiling some of the salt out the off steel. Out the pig steel, I love a steel, so I'm thinking about pig steel and the, the smoked turkey neck. So I'm gonna put them in now. And I added some garlic to this and bear you I didn't add any salt because you know these are already salty so we're just gonna pour that in that's the chicken foot and the gizzard I added also with the pig's tail and the smoked turkey neck I'm not gonna add the octopus nor the chicken breast because those cook very very fast so I'm gonna let these cook like maybe an hour or so then we're gonna go in with our pumpkin and you know our normal soup seasonings and everything some celery some corn and everything but I'm just gonna give this an hour so everything can like halfway cook cook through halfway so it's gonna be easier once everything is had in so we're gonna let this boil for an hour <laughs> So I just added my veggies and some yellow yam that I have here and as you can see the soup is looking so good already and you know we can't leave all the spinners out the soup now come on I'm now going in with my grace pumpkin soup mix guys and as you all know I like to do it like this but if you know you like to put the powder and the noodles and everything in it go ahead and do that but this is how I like it and then I'm gonna get everything seasoned up you know those little seasoning you use to season up your soup scallion thyme pepper a little piece of butter and everything yes so let's get rolling <laughs> Guys, we're turning up the kitchen. That's why the food is always so good because you know, it's always a party in the kitchen once we're cooking. So basically the soup is finished at this point, guys. Trust me, the soup is looking so good, so rich, so tasty, so delicious, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching this video and remember if you like this video give it a like share comment and of course subscribe and i'll see you in the next video